Alright guys, I'm back at it again with the Pokemon Go update, and don't know why I just said that, but currently my last video, I think I was either level 22 or 23, and my highest Pokemon were like Titty Boy and fucking Brittany Griner, which is Neo Queen and Nido King, and right now I'm like sitting at almost halfway 57,000 out of 150,000 XP, which is gonna take forever. Which has been taking forever to level up now that like I'm mid twenties, but I've caught a lot of raw Pokemon, like these two fucking Aerodactyls, as Eater and Aerodactyl. I got two of those in one day. First one, I got 90 CP. Second one, 154. And I'm thinking like, look at how far it can go on the bar like I, like people were catching like 1200 1300s like even that still look like kind of low for me at this point but like 154 like i catch fucking weedles better than that shit and a fucking another pokemon i was hella disappointed over i got a 510 electa buzz and like that was just terrible but at least that one popped up like on the screen like randomly but this 974, I ran probably three minutes, which, well, like, if you guys were around Cleveland, I ran from, like, the front of the sign center all the way to the end of the pier by where, like, the Cleveland sign is, which is a far run. It definitely took a few minutes, but if somebody was saying, there's an Electa Buzz, because they were using, like, Poke Notify or Poke Radar or one of those cheating apps, and they said there's only two minutes left, so we fucking bolted. It was, like, ten of us just running. And people were catching like 13, 1400s, which is raw. Like, but I got a 974, which is, I mean, hypothetically, that's not really that bad. Uh, but at where I am now, it's not that good either. Like, the moves, though, is pretty good Thunder Shock and Thunder. Like, that's a solid electric Pokemon. I don't really have a good one. Besides so Jolteon, which is, like, decent, because Jolteon's kind of boo boo. But as we look at my highest ones, you see, I'm actually controlling two, four, six. I'm controlling seven gyms right now. Well, my top ones are like six, and then I also have Ass Eater, which is controlling a gym because I'm a fucking Bausch. Me and my buddy had the same exact level Aerodactyl, so we just named him Ass Eater and put him on a gym. So I just cashed out right before I came home, and it was like fucking 4.30 when we did this, so nobody's going to be taking these gyms till at least a few more hours when anybody wakes up. So, my... I have a couple uh, Pokemon that are maxed out. My Gyarados is maxed out, 1930. Now, this dude took me a long time to get, but I'm also at 240 Magikarp candy as it is right now, because by the sign center and the pier down there is just fucking Magikarp heaven. But yeah, this one is, he's still a fucking beast. He's still a, he's still a Gyarados, but I feel like his moves could be better. Like Twister is, I don't even, I don't use Twister, but it's fucking 25 damage and it's boo boo. But like a dragon, dragon bath, it's pretty raw. But like if I had dragon bath and like hydro pump, wee hoo, I'd be fucking raw. This would be the best Pokemon ever. But I don't know. I wish I had a water type move with them. That'd be cool. But having the dragon is good for like fighting dragon Pokemon. But I also have my Lapras, which are ice, that are also very effective against dragon Pokemon. My best Pokemon though, high CP, and I honestly think is the best, is my Executor. He is a tank. He is a rapid attacking fiend boy with a nice solid 12 and then a decent uh, special attack move. Now, the one thing I regret is not having a grass type move on him. I have two psychic moves and I actually have a really, I mean, as you see, I have 18 candy and I could keep powering him up. But I don't want to. I, mean, I think he'd max out at probably like 2200-ish. But, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to save up candy so I can get another one. I actually have, let me look and see what level my execute. 654. So it's almost maxed out if you can see. And right now he has Psychic and Rock. But I don't know. Hopefully I get one that just knows a grass move, and then I can get a grass move executor, which would be dope. But he's just a tank and a total beast. Alright. And then uh, I've got a couple new Vaporeons. 
Actually, this Needle Queen is not the same one from last video. The same one from last video is right here. So I actually got a better one over time. I also got a second Needle King, but that one is lower than my Titty Boy. Titty Boy is still the reigning Titty Boy out here, boy, boy, boy. But I also got this beast. Slowbro is a great, great Pokemon. And he knows Water Gun and Ice Beam, which, like in my opinion, are his two best moves. I think you can get a better move than Ice Beam, though, if you want to be technical and go by the website. But another max out Pokemon I have is this Polyrath. And he is nicknamed the school dropout because he looks like that fucking bully at school that beats up everybody and it gets suspended and just fucking drops out and says fuck it. Now, his attacks are kind of weird because it's ground and ice and he's a water fighting Pokemon. But, I don't know. When I fight, like, I could fight a 1727 Vapor on equal CP and I think I could take it out just because... I mean, his water Pokemon and ground is obviously still good against, like, fire types and shit like water is. But then it's also good against, like, uh, ice Pokemon, like a Lapras or something as well. But, yeah, I got that. And then I got Ice Punches, which is, like, a low-key banger for those flying, for those dragon Pokemon and stuff like that. Now, in my last video, I told you guys a story about this Lapras. And, uh, it was a good story, but... I left work. Whew, I'm burping out here, man. I don't know what's going on. It's 5.30 a.m. Currently out here grinding out some videos for you guys. I'm exporting a fucking leaf green walkthrough gameplay. Go check that out, by the way. And my Lapras right here, 18.59. I caught him probably like 18.20 something, and I powered him up one. But I left work one day driving home, and I was like, yeah, I might as well check PokeVision, see if there's anything cool nearby. And there was a fucking Lapras sitting in Best Buy's parking lot by uh, my work. Went over there, got it. There was like eight minutes left. I was like a minute away. No rush, no nothing. And I looked at it. It was the question mark CP, which means if it says CP, question mark, question mark, question mark. When you go to catch it, it means that it is higher than the Pokemon you already have. So obviously at that time, I knew it was higher than a 1527. And it ended up being high as fuck. Like, when I caught it, it was my highest Pokemon. I had nothing else near it. I think my highest one besides that was Needle... Or, Needle King. What the fuck's a Needle King? He's obviously a Titty Boy, boy, boy. But yeah, Titty Boy... Whatever. My Victory Bell is still one of my favorites. He's just a grass beast. But I actually... So look down here. I actually have... God damn it, it's not sprawling. I actually have... Fuck. Another Victory Bell, obviously. But I also have a very high Weeping Bell, which I think is going to evolve into something better than the one I already have. But, as you guys can see, I've gotten a lot more Cliff Fables other than Taylor Swift, which is falling quite short to the other ones. Wrong, wrong lot right here, let me get centered again. But also I have the Hypno Bees, I have a maxed out Gold Dust, oh. Oh no, it was maxed out when I was level 23, or, yeah, 23. It's level 24 now, and... I don't know, he's still a raw Pokemon, but I'm not really worried about maxing him out. Because I have, as you can see, I have hella fucking gold ducks. I have a nice Starmie. I have multiple Hypno Slow Bros that are pretty high. Uh, I have another uh, Gloom that's like a 999, which is going to be a monster when I can evolve it. So I only need five more candies to evolve it. Bill Cosby is still kind of a trash ass fucking Magmar. Uh, I've gotten hella Tentacruels. And you got the Hypno Army out here, you know how it is. And yeah, pretty much from here on out, there's not too many new guys. Besides Dugong's new, Gengar's new. Gengar is a super disappointment. Like, he has a decent moveset, and he's just a raw Pokemon. Like, I've always loved Gengar. But if you look, he's only a 1206, and his bar doesn't get that bigger. Like, here, you know what, I'm just gonna fucking power it up just for you guys. Wow. The game really just lagged. <sighs> well, we're gonna have a little, uh, little pause right here, real quick, and we're just gonna check it out. Do, 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 do. I probably should edit up. Yeah, I probably should edit this out the video, but y'all know how. It, oh shit! They already took these gems. I was just up here, up there, being those gems early. Okay, what was I talking about? Fuck. Yeah. 
Well, I'm a fucking donkey. Oh, yeah, Gengar. Like, Gengar could be, like, I don't know. It looks like he could only grow up to, like, a 1400, 1500, and that's fucking nothing. Nothing anymore, at least, whatever. I have a failed Rainer. A little Flareon right there. A million of those things. Yeah, Wigglytuff is new. He's hella weak, too. Uh, Persian is new. I had high hopes for this dude, but look, he's only 977, and he's, like, almost maxed out, which is trash. This Ponyta is going to be a fucking beast, but it's the only one I've ever caught. So, it's going to take a while. Uh, I got Helotoros. This Slowpoke. Ten more candies. He's going to be a monster. It's my, oh, it's my highest Slowpoke I've ever caught. He's going to be a beast. Ooh, I got the Twitter notifications, though. Uh, yeah, the, six, seven, the 654 is actually like, going to be a beast. I caught a lot of uh, Kabutos tonight, too, which is raw. But yeah, other than that, I have a 10k egg cooking it up in the incubator. Uh, yeah, other than that, we out here sitting at halfway through 24 almost. And we're just going to keep grinding. I'll keep you guys updated when I find out any new tricks or tips or fucking anything. I'll let y'all know and I'll post a video about it. But thank you guys for watching. And if you really stayed this far in the video, I fuck with you heavy boy. But, uh, or girl. Don't want to be like triggering any of you feminists out there even though I probably just did by saying trigger 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 feminist <sighs> dislike this video if you just saw that but if you fucks with it like and subscribe and thank you for watching